What's up everybody and welcome back to a uh, Madden Ultra Team 16 video. I've just got you know, a pack opening for you and a couple market tips that I, well most of you guys have seen but that I think of. So tomorrow as you know is the first or today's the first as we put up on Wednesday. So BCA packs, most people expect, I expect BCA packs will come out. So team wise if you have elites, hopefully you sold them all because prices are going to drop. I know they will. Just because the amount of elites I'd be drawn out of those packs. And, um, yeah, so hopefully you guys get rid of those. If not, keep them. Do not sell them for a while because the prices are going to drop. And you're going to want to keep them. Oh! 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 Out of a free pack, Joe Hayden. Holy best pull yet this year. 88 overall. Joe Hayden, check him out. Bit on the slow one, but he's definitely. He'll be a good corner. I'm not sure if I'll keep him or sell him yet, but that's a great pull there out of a free pack too. That just proves that you can get out of pre-ordering the pack. You get you can get players like this. That's a huge a huge pull there, and that's our first one. We got two left. But yeah, so if you had elites or goals, hopefully you sold them. If not, hopefully you're happy with them because prices are gonna go down for a while now with these packs. I may open up some. I'm not quite sure as we get Eric Ebron there. And final pack coming up right now. Michael Thomas again. And Stefan Nicholas. Okay. So we got we got Joe Hayden. I'm not even going to complain about that. Out of a free pack two, we get Joe Hayden. So I'm going to quickly check how much he goes for. As those are my three free packs. So we'll go into the marketplace right now. But yeah, I'll probably... I probably won't open up BCA packs just because that promo last year was not that good to me. And this year I just don't see that I'm wait I'm gonna wait for the Thanksgiving. Because there's always good cards that come out around that time. With the uh, promos I got going on, the sets. Last year they had the food set and that gave you some good cards. How much is he going for? 82k. So I may put him up for 80k, see what he goes for, make some quick coins, or I may keep him. I am not quite sure, but yeah, so let's check out, there's some new legends that came out, so we'll go check them out quickly, I've, they've been out for a while now, but I'll just let you guys know about them, halfback, can't remember their names right now, so I'll just quality, go to the Jets, but um, yeah, so, these, I don't know, you guys let me know if you, wanna if I, if you want me to open up the BCA promos, I'm not quite sure on them. Oh, what? Whatever, I won't. Oh, let me just check the names and I'll go into it. But, yeah, there's nothing else that I can really say. This is just supposed to be a quick video. And so it's Andre Reed and Curtis Martin. Those are the legends. Curtis Martin, you pull from packs. Andre Reed, you gotta do the set for. And while I'm in, why don't I just do I got a couple new players I'll show you guys. Most of the lineup is the same. I did pick up, who is this? I can't know. Brandon Linder, he's got great stats. 89 run block, 95 pass block, 82 impact. I'm looking for a solid card that can block for run and pass, so he fit it perfectly. And I got Joel Betonio, and 92 run block, 91 pass block, and 84 impact. So again, great blockers. And I do have Jason Witten at 1 and Greg Olson at 2 now, since the Rob Gronkowski dropped. I picked up T.Y. Hilton for a slot receiver really quick. He burns, gets past the safeties almost all the time. He's a bit on the uh, small side, as he's only 5'9", but the speed definitely makes up for it. And on defense, I did pick up Thomas Davis, another 3-4, or 4-3 outside linebacker. Not bad speed, got good pursuit and good hit power for a linebacker. And I'm thinking about picking up the Ryan Chazier Schefter star, since Carlos Downsby is slower. He only has 78 speed, not that fast, so I'm thinking about picking up a new one. And my corners, they're only 84 and 82, but again, Rogers Cromartie plays like an elite, and so does Antonio Cromartie. And the rest is the same. Kicker-wise, I still got Brandon McManus, who has 97 kick power. His accuracy is a bit lower, but I'll take the 97 kick power no matter what. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick update video and the pack opening, where we ended up pulling Joe Hayden for free. I'll, def I'll take that 100 times. I I'll take it all the time. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As you see, we're 10 and two, 8 and 2 on the season heading into the playoffs. Got a first round bye. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like and subscribe for more content. Peace.